Ready for a no meat, no egg, no dairy, fast, low cost, little energy to make, great tasting meal, then let's make one. Hey, you're gonna love this. This is uh, one of my favorites to eat. It's so quick and easy to do. Uh, I, I, it costs you about maybe $2, depending on where you shop, but maybe $2.50 to $3 to make it. Uh, you go someplace to get a veggie burger like this, probably gonna cost you $15. So, and it's quick and fast and uses very little energy. So what I've got here is I've got my veggie patty, which I'm gonna put in the microwave. And I'm gonna show you that takes a, that's from frozen to edible in a minute and 30 seconds. It's just beautiful. And it just comes out fantastic. I love it. And I've got portobello mushrooms, which I just did uh, because I usually do these up in batches and it takes about four minutes. So I've already done these and I love to have the broth afterward because I'm probably gonna have some soup later on today because it's a very cold day today. And I just love to make that into that a couple of soup, different types of soups. And you've seen some of the, maybe you have have not, but I do some have some videos on how to make that broth into a soup, yeah, different types of soups. Uh, I've got some avocado and I've got the mixed herb and that's all going on the bread with a little bit of uh, green scallions. So I'm just gonna prep this bread and then it's gonna go in the toaster oven just for a little bit to warm it up. That's all it's gonna do. I take a little bit of this center out, just a little bit, and I give it to the birds actually. Uh, it just makes a kind of a cavity in here easier for everything to stay in place. So that's all I really do with that. And I do it at the top and the bottom. I just remove maybe a quarter of an inch on both sides. It just helps hold everything in and not kind of slop around because it's, you know, wants to work its way out. Uh, just take a little bit out. That's it. Not much at all. Uh, and like I say, I just, I give it to the birds outside. They love it. Okay, so this goes into the toaster oven. Just, just to, as all I'm gonna do is warm it up a uh, minute and a half. As long as it takes to this, I'm putting this in the microwave. And that's a minute and 30 seconds. Okay, uh, nothing here to prep, nothing to do, so I'll be back as soon as both of those come out. Okay, I'm back. Everything's out, ready to go. I'm just gonna assemble this. You're, you're just gonna really love this because of the simplicity of it. So there's my nice steaming hot veggie burger, veggie patty, excuse me. So what I do with this, because it's going on French bread, is I just quarter it. So I make four pieces just like that, and then I lay them in here, just like that. Kind of get the tips right on the top of that. It fits this bread perfectly if you cut the bread right. So you can see what that looks like. I've just got them lined up in there, okay? I'm gonna take the avocado. I'm gonna make some slices out of it. Three slices just like that. This is, for me, it's about a third of an avocado, maybe a little less. Um, I like a lot of avocado on this. So we can get it all out of here. Okay, great. Uh, then I'm just gonna lay this, the two big pieces in here, crossing each other. And then I'm gonna cut the little one just to fill in the holes on both sides. Okay, just like that. So you can kind of see what that looks like. Okay, that's done. All right, and then I'm gonna take some of this uh, portobello mushroom and I'm gonna lay this in here. That's gonna wanna slide around on you. I like quite a bit of portobello mushrooms, so I put a little bit more than maybe you would. And uh, then I'm gonna just take some onions. Of course, I forgot my favorite tool. I'm just gonna chop these up right over the top. Not too many, but just enough to give it some nice oniony flavor. Just like that. I'm gonna take my spicy mustard. I'm just gonna put a line of it right down. No, I'm not. I'm gonna open it up first. 
forgot this was a new one. Okay, let's try that again. I'm just going to put a line straight down my burger, just like that. It's enough for me. I'm going to take my mixed greens. I'm going to lay them in here because I'm going to just fold this over. And this can get a little unruly. Okay, so just like that. And then I'm going to flip it over. And just like that. And give it a little bit of a panini press type thing there going on. These excess pieces you can stuff in here somewhere in the excess onions, just like that. And there it is. You ready to eat? How good could that be? That's like fantastic. And what I'm gonna do on the side is my favorite potato chips. Two ingredients, olive oil and potato. That's it. I love these. I don't eat them all the time, but they are the best. Just like that. And there you have it. Great lunch sandwich, ready to go. Remember, the best investment you can ever make is in your health. I'm Foodmaker V, and I'll see you next time.